Hey guys, it's me, Christina. I just wanted to do a video based on my makeup that I'm doing for Halloween. Um, I'm doing Moulin Rouge. At first it was going to be burlesque, but everybody says it looks more like Moulin Rouge, so it makes sense to run with that. Um, so far, I've only done half of my face, um, just so you guys can get a general idea just of it. Um, you can't really see too much, I guess, um, but it's black eyeshadow, black liner, black shadow going up with hints of red you can't really see the hints of red unless I go into light you see red a little bit in the tear duct eye eyeliner in the waterline I use eyeliner on the top part but um I covered that up a little bit with a shadow just so it didn't look so harsh as you can say and I did a little bit of a loop here but it was just to be able to connect all of this this is literally just um my black liquid liner which is this one from MAC from MAC that I had that um I used um the last time you guys saw that was when I did um when I was previously gonna do the Lady Gaga costume you guys saw those swirls all over my face brought to you by Geo did all those swirls um but the eyeshadow and all that was me which I want to do a tutorial on that makeup because that was actually so much fun um but I did it again for my Moulin Rouge one because I figured it would give it a little bit more flair a little more me I guess um to do the swirls but at first I did it with my white eyeliner um let me see my white eyeliner by wet n wild it's a wet n wild one i did it as a liner um to get it the gist of it so i can get it correct i guess you can say and then i did the black mac over it so that it's black with a little bit of my red makeup here that i have uh it's milani milani it's red it's supposed to be for the lips but i use it for other things too like shadows and stuff so i did it onto here onto the black to give it a little bit more color but it's only looking like shading around it but it came out really cute either way um my lips are just a basic um halloween black lipstick um the color workshop red of course like super super red my mom got this years ago i think for one of her old costumes so I'm, I've, it's lasted it's not gooey it's not usually what makeup turns into after years of use but I guess since we only used it for Halloween and just sat there, nothing really happened, but I used it. Um, I wouldn't recommend it. You're supposed to change your makeup every few like every few months, but it's a Halloween-based costume um, makeup, and this is, you know, it's whatever. It's fine. I used that, and then I used a little bit of that same um, Milani um, lip flash. See, this is lip flash. I put it on top just to give it a little shimmery look because my lipstick was very just bland red. A little shimmery. And then my lips, I already did the contouring to make them big, but I actually used that lip flash to do, um, to make, like, the contouring to make them bigger. And then I'm, I did lip gloss, which yeah, is, awesome. but, and I did, uh, Sally Hansen, sorry, that was my grandmother. Um, Sally, I thought she left, but she came back. Um, Sally Hansen's, uh, lip inflation. My lips, I did, you know, I do contouring and my lips are a little bit big. At least my bottom lip is pretty big already. But I like to make them look bigger. I don't know why. I don't feel like it's big enough. Whatever. I do it anyway. It looks pretty. See? <laughs> so, I use this lip inflation and it does a singling sensation to my lips and makes them feel bigger. So, it's like, yay! I kind of turned it red over the years. It was clear! <laughs> Now it's this pink and peach color. I mean, it still comes on clear with maybe a hint of color after a while. Like, when I just use it without any lipstick. But, it's freaking red, dude. Like, <laughs> I ruined this. <laughs> I've had this for years, too. I've had this for a very long time. I used to use it for Halloween. Uh, when I used to do blood for drama class. I would use a little bit of lip gloss, a little bit of lipstick. And then I would put this over to make it like a thicker substance. Put a little bit of red lip gloss on it. And it looked like blood. That was my costume for school. I just did like blood on my face. So that was funny. Um, let me see. Oh, and these are my shadows. Just so that you know. Because um, I didn't show you guys. I'm going to do my other eye later. And then post the pictures up on Facebook. Um, just so you guys get a full look of it. But for right now, this is basically what's going to happen over here. Except without the swirls. It's the same thing my eye but for my costume the only thing that I'm adding which I don't want to add right now um I don't have them with me I have to go get them but for under my eye look my puppy wait where is she Lola come here that's my puppies my lollies she's my little schnauzer she just stood there like holy crap she's talking to me 
Um, I have these little sticker rhinestones of in red that I'm gonna put along the eye uh, along the bottom of my waterline, like right under my bottom lashes, or even so maybe just like right here, just because my eyelashes are like right there. I don't really have too much fun to work with in that area, so I'm just gonna put it like maybe right here, like little diamonds, red diamonds. And that's going to be repeated on this side too, going out this way. Maybe even just on the top, like one row on the bottom and one row on the top on this side. That's my idea so far. Um, these are my shadows, just to, so you guys can see. Rimmel London, this is what I have when it comes to the black. Um, this one's really old that I've had for a long time. Like I said, you have to switch out your makeup all the time, so I bought myself a new one. I use that one mostly just for costumes and stuff because it's so old. But this is my brand new one that I use for my going out makeup. So this is not for costumes or anything like that. Um, this one's actually pretty cool. This is L'Oreal. I like this one because all of the colors are actually engraved numbered in it. If you can kind of see it. You see it? And um, it's for the back. I, I didn't buy this for this purpose. I actually really needed th these colors because I, I mostly use them. Because I like to do a lot. When I go out, I do, you know, the... the um, the smoky eye always I mean everybody does but I always stick to these colors when it comes to smoky eye because I typically wear back sometimes um what's cool about this one is on the back because of the numbers of what they're for this is to show you what each of those colors where you're supposed to put them and this is to create a smoky eye um which I thought was pretty damn cool that they have that because not a lot of people know how to do smoky eyes or do smoky eyes properly and they struggle with it and this actually gives you that little bit of extra to know how to do it so I thought that was pretty cool that they had that little tip in there. Kind of helps me too because I did it a little weird. I had my own way and I wanted to learn how to like really do it. And this was my little helper. So I have that. I have a bunch of other colors. I'm going to do maybe a haul of all my colors and all my makeup that I actually have now that I actually own a lot of makeup. And I'm getting into that. So I might do a mini haul of my makeup bag. So far, just so you guys can see the gist of it. Look at all that freaking makeup. I have a little more but it's all like mostly like costumey stuff you see like I have like these like when I was gonna do Lady Gaga this is gonna be my lip gloss which I'm kind of disappointed I'm not doing that but it's a lot of sewing involved because I was gonna create my own version of Lady Gaga but I'm really happy with my costume and I'm gonna be posting that up um pictures of me in my costume when I have it all complete and when I don't get lazy and actually curl my hair <laughs> Well, that's it. I just wanted to show you guys the gist of it. I didn't want to do the other side because, number one, I have to take this off. You know, I have, a, I have stuff to do today. I can't really be doing this crazy makeup and then spending hours trying to wipe it off. Um, I just wanted to do this side since it's more dramatic. It has this on it um, so you guys can see the idea of it. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you guys really like it and what you if you guys have any suggestions to let me know. And peace, love, and war.